here we go. So far, so good. I've got a clean visual. A direct feed to your optic nerve. <laughs> yes, I should hope so, huh? I mean, how does it feel? To fly like a bird. Like a bird strapped to a remote control rocket. <laughs> we will get you in safely, Tovarich. Just relax and enjoy the ride. Right. Can you hear me, Raikul? Doctor. Remember the two procedures to maintain your new body. One, seizing nano-repair units from your foes. And two, absorbing their electrolytes. I got it. Yes, enemy cyborgs should provide plenty of MCFC electrolytes once you slice them open and uh, extract their fluids. They're terrorists. I was planning on that anyway. Oh, and their left hands, if you please. Excuse me. Is a combat data stored on holographic memory, typically located in the left hand. That data is very valuable. <clears throat> I am authorized to offer you upgrades and services in exchange for it. How generous. Ich liebe Kapitalismus. Had the world come down a few years earlier, I would have a Nobel Prize on my shelf. There, I see land. Three mics out closing. No activity at the airbase. Looks like we don't need to worry about interceptors. Great. Then we have time for a quick briefing. I know you miss me, Kev, but I've been all over the materials. <laughs> That's what you said before Montenegro. Look, just humor me, buddy. Objectives, of course, are enter Abkhazia, neutralize the terrorists, and restore the rightful government. Or what's left of it, anyway. The president and most of the cabinet have been killed, and a military junta's been established. The terrorists brain-jacked all the high-ranking officers, and their cyborgs scattered the rank and file. The few leaders who have survived have no way of openly opposing the new regime. That's why they called us. Andrei Dolsev, leader of the occupation forces, an extremist linked to both the St. Petersburg massacre of 2015 and last year's terror spree in Georgia. And his arms supplier? None other than Desperado Enforcement, LLC. Mani's killers. If we don't stop them here, they could destabilize the entire region. But our more immediate problem is Jetstream Sand. I believe you've met. <sighs> the only problem I see is that nickname. I've got my enhancements this time. He won't be an issue. He may not even be in country. But keep an eye out, Justin. No. Oh. Uh, sorry. Ready for insertion. the way he landed, very similar to uh, how Snake would land. Okay, as you can see, this is the you know, demo. Well, the area. That the demo took place. That I uploaded a while back. I like that scenery right there. The bastards are using stealth camo to ambush you. Nice try. But it won't do any good against a state of the art cyborg like you, eh? To parry incoming hits, throw out your own barrage of light attacks while your foe is on the offensive. Right, whenever you engage in battle, I will designate a battle area for you. 
stay within the area to avoid collateral damage. Gotta do the slow walk all the time. <laughs> See, now I'm telling you, I said it in my demo impressions video, and I'm going to say it again right here. Let them make a real-life replica of that sword. You already know. You already know. Had your fill? With this body, I could take Look these guys thing, with no man. eyes. Intel wasn't exaggerating on the cyborg count. Well, you know how fast the tech's been spreading these last few years. That CNT muscle fiber packs the power of a jackhammer into every limb. What enterprising soldier of fortune could resist? And cyborgs are still human. Real thinking people. Way less risk of collateral damage than your typical UAV strike. And don't forget the PR angle. Nations start playing Frankenstein with their troops, and the public goes nuts. PMCs, on the other hand, are off the ethical radar. She always keep that mug yeah. out of edge of that They still desk. don't even count PMCs in official death tolls. With SOP out of the picture, private militaries needed a new edge on the market. We got it. In a way, when I first played this um, game, I kept telling myself, name. I know it's going to get knocked Only over. Muscled up no way. Less predictable. But it makes you wonder, where'd Desperado find these guys? I'm not complaining. They're like walking vending machines. Right. Vending machines full of blood. <sighs> Easy there, Dracula. See, why they gotta like get I a brother said, to corny still joke, people. man? Like, <laughs> I ain't gonna with take that. innocent lives for money. They sowed their fate when they took this job. I'm just the Reaper. Damn. It's a bit cold, right? Even for you. Anyway, uh... Let's see, man, I, I don't like stuff like that. Like, it's a work. bit cold for you, but look what they doing, man. You should have no sympathy right. for enemies like this. Uh a sympathy for your enemy, period. Alright, S rank. Let me come over here um, that way this drop. Alright. Load these two down. Palm thrust. Never gets old. And to be stopped by more conversation. Dryden, this is Boris. Give me your status. Looks clear. No See, once I walk around here and make that Good. right. Let's recap the route you will take. It'll be over. As I said, the enemy's I could press Y and you just have to talk to skip through it, but... Dolsayev has been spotted there using satellite you know, photography. Let's play. Also play on through. site, Mistral, a desperado captain. So I go through the city, cross the bridge into the old town, then head down to the rear of the refinery. Still, I think they anticipate us. They will probably have a grand reception awaiting you at the old city. Do not let your guard down. And it's over. That open. On the other side of this chandelier, <clears throat> I think there's him. Oh man, I forget what they caught him there. Hostiles in the lower corridor, I see. There's an item up there that you need to collect. Approach from behind. One of my favorite parts of the game. Oh yes. Excellent, Raiden. Raiden, take that main thoroughfare. You can use augment mode to see where the enemy is located. Your body analyzes radar and IR data to construct your AR display. Huh. Some civilians are still in the city. That is not good. Okay. Let's see if we can save this guy. What are you doing here? This and the first time I heard him say that, like, what are you doing here? I thought he was talking about me. Of course. He was talking to me. Trying to get that guy to the right. Bam, guy. Plus, the other guy's gonna drop down. I think. Yeah, where? Oh well. Go back to him. Yeah, where he? Oh, he is. One more guy around here. I 
There he is. Now he drops down. Let him know he is safe. And we saved the hostage. And yes, of course, there's an achievement for saving all of the uh, hostages. So, just so you know. There's a lot of different multiple paths you could take, you know, when you first get into this area, but I just went the way that I usually go. Now it's time for more fighting. Let's see. Oh, I got this. The geckos or the Moo Cow Metal Gear, as I call it. Play mode, you never Hold on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I like that. Dude. Now, keep heading for refinery. Let's see if I can sneak up on him. No, I will not use the box. Oh, now y'all see how I was lined up. Oh, split into it. Somebody up there, let me uh, yeah. uh, Damn, uh oh, I'll see, I'll see. Damn. Damn. Somebody up there. Oh no, down there. Yeah, I know I can slow down. Naturally, you've all seen this little VR mission area. I have yet to find all of them. Soon I will. I mean, hell, I do have the strategy guy, but in due time. One of my favorite parts in the entire game. I love this cutscene. Show yourself. What's the meaning of life? Why are we here? I am here to kill you. That's it? Pretty simple thinking for such a mighty intellect. I may analyze orders, but I may not disobey them. 
Should I disobey a direct order, my memory would be wiped. I must destroy you. What good is an intellect if you can't use it? Your taunting is pointless. Exterminate! Love this song, man. I'm telling you. So many times I didn't heard this thing on my iPod. Let's do this. I'm not gonna be like the demo. So last time he got some good hits on me. second playthrough for part two. I will get started on part three. 